Hi guys, today is Thursday. Two mornings into this early shift. Let me put y'all here. Cool. Two mornings into the early shift and so far it's doing good. You know, I I only have, it's not two mornings. Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, three mornings into the early shift and so far it's doing good. Um, I have two shifts to go, two days to go for the rest of this week's shift and then next week it should be the same thing again I came home last night and had the, what I thought was the smartest idea and that was to wash my hair now I washed my hair and uh, I don't think it's jarred because this morning when I undid the braids to redo them I realized that it was kind of cool you know but hopefully tying it with the satin scarf helped with it drying down a little bit quicker I'm just having a cup of coffee right now and then afterwards I'm gonna have some cereal this morning I really feel like eating light those other days yesterday yesterday and the day before I had like actual breakfast like eggs sausage um, bread and like a cup of coffee still and it did what it did you know it lasted for a very long while but then too one of my friends had texted me this morning she was like my baby is here and I'm literally so happy for her and I'm so excited to hear how it went but then too I know that I kind of have to give her some time to soak up the tiny slug snuggles and everything as a new mom so I'm just like all right congratulations I'm so proud of you take your time and I can't wait to hear how it went because I think a day ago or so I was asking her you know how are you how's baby girl because for the last couple of weeks we've been going back and forth on Monday we were talking we we're going back and forth for a very long while she was saying she don't know what to do with her hair and i'm like girl just braid it up because you know when you have a newborn the last thing you want to worry about is having your hair to do because it's already so much trying to adjust to you know being a new mom and caring for somebody else that you know you don't want to think about yourself for a while you just want to get all that down and Pretty much kick yourself into a routine where it's easy on you and on your body so we were talking about that and she said you know I have eight days left and I'm like she could literally come any minute now and here she is three days later so I'm so proud of her and so happy for her and you know she did mention that she was tired and I feel like most people experience that when they're coming closer to the end of their pregnancy like you're so tired so um I was just like, you know, you don't have that long left to go. So I'm glad that she actually had her daughter today. So I'm going to sit here, drink this coffee, and then um, make my cereal and pretty much head to work when I'm done. Because in the mornings, I only have so much time before I actually have to dip. One of my friends on Instagram, every morning she makes these, um, I don't know if you call them shake or juice. It's like all fruits though, so it's probably a shake and they look so good and I don't really like fruit juice like that, but I can't lie, they look so good and so healthy. And uh, in efforts to try and eat healthy and just do better with my health, maybe that's something I should jump on. And I do have the little thing like a magic bullet or whatever it's called where I could use to do this. I'm just, I don't know. Maybe I should make them overnight or so. I'm gonna try this week, but you know, gotta be for the next day off because now I don't have the time. So I bought these laundry hampers to put um, the dirty clothes in instead of to have them in just the bag. But I feel like now seeing this in person, 
this too is kind of like a bag in itself. So now I'm just like, okay, whatever. I just wasted $9, $18. But I bought this because I felt like um, what bothers me the most is the light. So, like, when I'm sleeping, if I wake up and, like, open my eyes, I feel like the sleep goes away. So, if I do wake up, I can't open my eyes. I remember um, last night, I woke up for a little bit and I was just there with my eyes closed, feeling to get to the bathroom because I just felt like... Once I opened my eyes, I wouldn't be able to go back to sleep, so I needed this. I had one that was green and I think gray, but I cannot find it. I'm not sure why. But I actually really like this one, and it's the outside it feels like either silk or satin. I'm not sure if silk and satin is the same thing. Probably isn't, because it's called something different. But on the end, and then I got these little, what are these called? Air muffs to go in a set of my ears. I don't know if I'll use these. Maybe I will because Dillian snores. So maybe I will. One time the snoring would bother me, but I feel like now it doesn't really bother me as much. I mean, I still hear it, but it doesn't bother me as much. I just got home from work. It is 8.30. I should have been home a while ago, but um, the last train was del delayed. So that took a little while. Um, yeah. So I think what I'm gonna do right now is fold the dirty laundry and put them in this. I'm gonna actually go get the bag. The purpose of the bag was one for me and one for him, but the way how this is looking, it don't look like it's gonna hold his stuff because his stuff is full to capacity. Quick, too. <laughs> so I don't know if I'm gonna get my laundry bag in like, so I plan on just taking this stuff out and I throw them on the floor because this bag I want to put inside of the thing, you know, so that when I'm actually going to go to do my laundry, I can just take this out and then Still fine, but I'm actually gonna fold the stuff and put them in here. I hope the camera battery don't die. Probably will soon. So then when I'm ready to like take it off to go do the laundry, I'll just pull this out of it like that. So I'm gonna fold it over because I'm not ready to take it off yet. That one, Dwayne has to do his, but if I'm being realistic, I don't see him taking out the, um, the dirty clothes right now to fold it, to put it in a bag in that so it looks like it's gonna stay like that and then um, I think I'm gonna put these in the bedroom because um why because the other room we're gonna use it so it's gonna be a little inconvenient to be going in there on somebody to go push your dirty clothes away so I think this is gonna go in one room I'm not sure if that's gonna be a permanent thing yet but there's a space between the dresser and the chest like a little triangular space so i want to just drop those in there but i think i'm gonna leave them out here in the living room 
this on until like in the morning because I'm about to go shower right now and go to bed. I was changing to go shower and then I'm like, oh crap, let me show you guys what I got. So I just threw this on with my leggings. I'm about to go change and shower and stuff and I guess I'll see you guys in the next video or in the next clip. Who knows at this point? <laughs>